Yo, what's up? Good morning. Look at this gorgeous day. Sitting on the patio at my restaurant and it's already freaking 87 degrees. Like, whoa, it's going to go to 95 degrees today, man. If you guys live down south, you're loving it right now. I'll tell you that. I used to live up in New York and we had a pool in New York and the water never got warm. You know what I'm saying? It was always cloudy. It was raining like every other day. You couldn't jump in the pool because the water was so freaking cold. Down here, my pool is already 90 degrees, y'all. 90 freaking degrees. That's right. You just jump right in, man. It's almost like you're in a hot tub. It's so amazing. So bye-bye, New York. Loving the South. Yeah, buddy. We're two hours. We're in uh, the outskirts of uh, Birmingham, Alabama. Two hours from Atlanta. Uh, we're only like five hours from Mardi Gras. Three hours from the beach. Oh, it's gorgeous, man. Y'all move down south. So, okay, Dogecoin right now trading at 30 cents. AMC, market's open, baby. She's hitting 54.55. I'm loving that. Maybe we get a really nice green day today out of AMC. Um, I was going to do my question, my Q&A yesterday down in my studio at my house. So uh, that was cool. I asked in three different platforms to send me some questions. And then, so I got a lot of questions. Then I talked myself out of doing the q and I'm sorry. I did. I talked myself out of it. And the reason being is because I was going to go full face down in my studio. I was just like, screw it, man. I'm just going to do this and have fun with it. Um, but I talked myself out of doing the full face, man. I was like, no, if I'm going to do my studio and a lot of people are sending me ideas, which I love y'all because these are great freaking ideas. Um, some of y'all are saying to wear like the wrestling or no. Yeah, some of y'all are actually sending me wrestling masks, which, holy cow, like some of my friends gave me some of their WWE masks that they wear. Um, some of y'all are saying, wear the masks that go with these costumes that I wear. That's an awesome idea. Uh, my wife gave me makeup. She said, dress up like an Indian. I mean, there's a million different ideas, and I'm going to go with one of them. I kind of, I got some really cool wrestling masks uh, from some buddies of mine. Um, but anyhow... I talked myself out of it. Sorry, I am going to do it. I uh, just got to come up with a more creative way because I'm having too much fun with the half face and I'm just not going to blow it, man. Not going to ruin it. All right, let's talk about this con man that's going around the Dogecoin community. It's really bad for investors. It's giving a bad image to Dogecoin. It's not fake news. It's just blatant lies. It's deceitful and it's conning people. Uh, this person goes by Crypto Lion. Crypto Lion. And imagine that. Even got the word lion in your name, don't you, Crypto Lion? Because you always lion, boy. Don't know who you are, but I don't like you. I don't like you because you blatantly lie. It's not fake news. You're deceitful. You think up, you think up of the most absurd lies you can come up with. And you spin a video around that lie and you upload the video and you con about 40, 50, 60,000 people. I don't know how you're getting the views you're getting. Now, the reason this was brought to my attention was I was going a uh, dollar on my Dogecoin end of year, one dollar. People ask me for that prediction. It's not really a prediction. It's pretty much where it's going to be. Um, maximum one dollar. And some people are like, dude, you're a hater. Why are you hating on Doge? Doge is going to ten dollars. Hey, watch this video. It says Doge is going to $100. And so I watch these videos, and uh, the links are being sent to me, and they're all coming from Crypto Lion. The first one was Dogecoin $100 because the CEO of Robinhood guarantees it. Second video, which was just put up only a few days ago, uh, Dogecoin end of week or next week, $10 because of Robinhood. Those are the two, the only two I watched because I was just absolutely disgusted with this person, whoever it is, you disgust me. Uh, basically, let's do the $10 one next week based off of Robin Hood wallets. And he also says that financial advisors agree and they just don't want to put their names out there. Uh, financial advisors agree. Many financial advisors, by the way. So that's total bullshit. You are 100% bullshitting yourself and you're bullshitting everybody around you. Um, you're trying to get likes. You're trying to get clicks. I guess there is a certain amount of money you need to make on YouTube. And therefore, you are just shoving it to your viewers. You are shoving it straight up the Dogecoin community's butts, man, aren't you? That's the way you get ahead in life, right? You just con people out of cash. You con people. 
This is one of those dudes because he's so far fetched on YouTube. He's such a liar on YouTube. He's such a con man that in the real world, I guarantee you this guy's got real cons going on that he is stealing money from people. Like, you know, those, uh, you get that email that it says, hey, you just inherited $40 million, but in order to receive the inheritance, you got to send us 20,000. This dude's probably behind that shit. I guarantee you he's got those kind of cons going on. Total blatant disregard for everybody investing in Dogecoin. Total blatant disregard for your money. He wants to take your money. He does not want you to make money. And he's a liar. You know, it pisses me off because what happens if you got all these all these kids now coming in investing in Doge thinking they're going to get rich? And you got an asshole like this that says, hey, man, put in $100 because per coin you're going to get $100 back. So you got a kid working like at McDonald's making no freaking money. And he dumps 100 bucks on Doge at 35 cents, which is where she was last week when this fool's putting these videos up. And then Doge drops to 30 cents. Hey, dude, what, what, what happened to my $100 a coin? Let's go, big shot, crypto liar. Yo, crypto liar, my $100 a coin, what happened? The kid works at McDonald's. You don't even make any freaking money. You're a jerk. You're a fool. You need to be taken down. You know, I don't know why YouTube lets assholes like you exist. But I want you guys to check his videos out. And I want you to start just staying away from this dude uh crypto lion you see a video come up on this fool he is damaging to the dogecoin community i hope nothing but the worst for this fella i don't like people like him coming around and influencing in a bad way in a very selfish way it's all about likes for this guy and it's all about uh whatever uh, that dollar amount that he's got to make on youtube that's all he's shooting for there is a difference between fake news and just blatant lies this dude is blatant lying crypto liar get off youtube fool all right everybody i gotta get to the gym um you want to know why because i gotta get this day done and over with got some work to do uh then we're gonna grab us a few drinks and go out to the pool today and uh finish tanning i got tan lines i gotta fill in and i'm uh, gonna chill with my wife gonna do that video this afternoon i hope the q a um i might wear one of these masks that were sent to me if i do look out for it guys all right, hope y'all have an awesome afternoon. Big Doge Warrior, baby. Let's go to the moon. Shaboom. Peace.